Kiko TV presents the wisdom of Hawaii's elders. Stories from our kupuna. I grew up in Pepekeo, Hawaii on the Big Island. I climbed trees and then I, I love to swim. So I used to swim in the river and you know, you would go and catch like opai or whatever, yeah? And the crayfish and all those things. I didn't like to stay indoors. So we would um, play out in the rain. When they had the rain, we would make mud pies and then we would play uh, marble. My parents, they were regular. My father worked for the Pepekeo Plantation and my mother was a housewife. On the Big Island, I went to Pepekeo Elementary, uh, Middle School, all the way from first grade to ninth grade, we all stayed together all the way. And then from ninth grade, when you graduate ninth grade, then I went to Hilo High School for uh, sophomore year and half of junior year until uh, our family moved to Honolulu. And then I went to McKinley High School where I graduated from in 1949. I didn't like Honolulu because I was so uh, comfortable living and all my friends were in uh, Big Island. We grew up together, but then I was so lucky because when I went to McKinley, I made very good friends, and today I still have my very close friends from McKinley. Graduated in 1953. My husband graduated from University of Hawaii in 1953, and then he had to go to Fort Benning, Georgia for training, and then he chose Fifth Army, which is Fort Ord, California, that he was assigned to. So we decided to get married in San Francisco, so I flew up to San Francisco. I started to take um, all these koto lesson, paranku, hula, and uh, um, what you call uh, ukulele, harmonica. I was raised in a Christian home, and my mother always said that if you cannot say anything nice about people, don't say anything, like Lucky Luck would say, don't say nothing. And I think that's a very good advice. 